to be the 220 pound title fighters. First, fighting out of the Farmers Insurance Red Corner, an independent fighter from Longmont, Colorado. Please make welcome to Warner. And fighting out of the last Cop Tavern Blue Corner from the Longmont Boxing Club in Longmont, Colorado. Please make welcome Jason Sanchez. 220 pound title bout is scheduled for three two in the rounds. Referee Steve Blair. Here we go, fight fans. Fight number two is also a title fight. This in the 220 pound division. We have Jason Sanchez from the Longmont Boxing Club. He's on the left of your screen facing off against Dutch Warner. He's on the right of your screen. Mr. Warner is an independent fighter. Warner has the red trim on his trunks. Referee Stephen Blea, third in the ring again. And Sanchez comes out looking to land with power. Warner swings the hook around and already Sanchez being warned to bring those punches up. Warner goes well to the body. Sanchez answers in kind. Warner with the decided height and reach advantage. But he takes a hard shot there. Sanchez eats a hard shot as he looked to step in. Gives his opponent a smile. Says, yeah, you caught me on that. And more good body shots land for Sanchez, trying to work the power. Good job by Warner using his height to come over the top on the separation there. Both these guys willing to just kind of step forward and engage. Not a lot of setting up on the punches here. Just do your best to get in range and fire away. And Sanchez bringing that right hand very low. And again, the fighters just step forward looking to trade power shots. Sanchez's corner going to be talking to him about how low his hands are. And Sanchez has to shake off that one. Felt the sting of Warner's power a little bit and another shot that was close to being low. And again, Warner able to score walking in. 10 second clacker sounded. And Warner gonna finish the round with a bit of a flurry. Round two in our second title fight of the evening. This is number two of four as far as title fights go. Jason Sanchez facing off against Dutch Warner. And Sanchez pressures forward early in the second round. I'm in the corner of Sanchez and I did hear his corner telling him they want those hands to stay up a little higher. And Sanchez going with the power shots to good effect here in round number two. Warner looks to answer back now a little bit staggered. And Warner with a bit of an angered look on his face. Warner going into stalking mode now. Sanchez, again, really low with that right hand. You can see him loading up with the left. And a good shot lands for Warner. Sanchez shakes it off, says that didn't hurt. Typically, that means that hurt. And again, Sanchez, good effect with the combinations. 
Something we saw in round number one from both fighters was their reliance on almost purely power shots. Coming out here in round number two, Sanchez moving his hands a little more, getting some combinations put together. And Sanchez having some fun in there this afternoon. Lots of smiles. Warner conversely. Very determined look on his face. And you can see the condition of these fighters starting to come into play a little bit. Both of them starting to be a little worn here. Partway through round number two. Good right hand for Warner. Oh, and the best punch of the fight lands there for Sanchez. Warner was staggered by that, trying to get his eyes clear. Ten-second clacker sounded, and both fighters just kind of wandering around the ring for a second. And it looks like we're going to a third. Round three in our 220 pound title fight. Referee Stephen Blay gets the fighters to the center for a little sportsmanship. Now they'll try to punch each other in the face until one of them's unconscious. And they both come forward swinging hard. That's gonna be ruled a slip, I do believe. And indeed it is. And Warner comes rushing forward but eats the big left hand from Sanchez. Both these guys looking to make their mark in round number three. See how they work in the clinch. Push each other away. Deep breaths coming out of both fighters. Think they both probably feel the fight as I do as one round to one. So this is literally the championship round. Might come down to being a bit of a war of attrition here as both fighters Taking some deep breaths, see who can gut it out here. Land some power shots in the third round. And Warner puts that reach to use. Sanchez gives him a smile, walks off. Referee kind of gives him a, hey, you're in the middle of a fight look. <laughs> Both these guys going to want to get a little busier here if they're looking to put their stamp on the third round. Now Sanchez gets a one-two combination. Warner stalking into range, but not letting go with the hands yet. And I think both of them just a little bit worried about making a mistake and getting knocked down or eating a hard shot. And there's a good flurry in the corner right as the 10 second clacker sounded. And we're taking it to the judges. Sean Patrick will give us the official word.
stay with you because he, I need a backup judge at times. He, he's done excellent. He was right with Steve Waldman. So we do. Teach him, teach him what Steve knows, not what you know. Sure. <laughs> Uh -huh. Alright, Sean, in the ring with Jason. You ready to go another round, man? I'll get you the soldier. Alright, now take it through that fight. It looks like you were looking for the home run all throughout that fight. You probably didn't expect it to go three rounds, but it did. You still come out on top. Yeah, I came out on top. I was looking for that power for that thing, but uh, we got to get, uh, get to my opponent and get into a couple of months. Couldn't get to him, but I got the win eventually. That's all that matters. Now, Tell me what's next for you. What's well, next is our championship. All right, he wants the belt. I guess he's done talking to me as well. Get it up for you. Winner, Jason Sanchez.